Hello, friends. Do you want to use Outlook 2013 to view the mails received on your Gmail account? Here are the steps to do so on your Windows 8.1 PC. Open a web browser and type www.gmail.com in the address bar and then press Enter on your keyboard. Log into your Gmail account, click on Settings icon, and then click Settings. Under the Forwarding and POP slash IMAP tab, make sure POP is enabled. Select Enable POP for all mails, even mail that's already been downloaded radio button, and then click on Save Changes. Minimize your web browser. Open Microsoft Outlook 2013. On the ribbon, click File. Under Info tab, select Account Settings, and then from the drop-down menu, select Account Settings again. On the Email tab, click New to add a new email to your Outlook 2013. Select the Manually Configure Server Settings or Additional Server Types radio button and click on Next. Select POP or IMAP and then click Next. Enter your username, email address, Make sure the account type is POP3. Type incoming mail server as pop.gmail.com and outgoing mail server smtp.gmail.com. Enter the login information. Click on the More Settings button. Select the Outgoing Server tab and then check My Outgoing Server SMTP requires authentication. Verify that the Use Same Settings as My Incoming Mail Server is marked as well. Select the Advanced tab and enter the Incoming Server POP3 value 995. Outgoing Server SMTP value 587. Set Use the following types of encrypted connection to TLS. Select the checkbox next to this server requires an encrypted connection, SSL. You also might want to uncheck the box to remove messages from the server after a number of days. This way your messages will still be accessible from Gmail online. Click OK to close the window and then click Next to finish setting up the account. Provided everything was entered correctly, you'll be greeted with a successful setup message. Click Finish. Click on Data Files tab to view the added account details. Close the Account Settings window. Gmail is now all ready to sync with Microsoft Outlook 2013. Wasn't that helpful? Thanks for watching.